there's this video called 10 Reasons Gay Marriage is Wrong. Now, coming from a pansexual guy, am I full on gay? No. But, I am queer in a way because I will date men. So, <clears throat> let's look at some of these bullshit reasons why gay marriage is wrong. Okay, reason number one. Being gay is not natural. Real Americans always reject unnatural things like eyeglasses, polyester, and air conditioning. Heh. Gay, be, being gay is unnatural or, or um, like eyeglasses, air conditioning, and, and what was the other thing? Polyester. Um, 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 I'm sorry, but how dumb is this person that put this together. First of all, in the animal kingdom, I mean, humans are part of the animal kingdom, but I'm talking about in the actual animal kingdom, uh, homosexuality acts, are, and I'm using it in a scientific way, homosexuality acts are natural and they do happen because there's animals out there that can change sex, that can change sexuality in an instant. Um, like frogs, for example. Frogs can be female for a uh, season of mating, and then the next season when it's not mating, they can go back to being male. So, um, are there acts of homosexuality in the animal kingdom? Yes. It's natural. It's natural. Humans should engage in some um, homosexual acts, but there's a difference difference between heterosexual and homosexual. Homosexual is same-sex attraction. Heterosexual is opposite-sex attraction. Now, when you put together, you get bisexual, but you could put all different types of things together, and you can get all different genders and all different sexualities. And so, um, human race is kind of interesting, but the human race practices more homophobic tendencies and it does homosexual tendencies. What's reason number two? <laughs> number two. Gay marriage will encourage people to be gay in the same way that hanging around tall people will make you tall. Once again, this person's dumb. Okay, let, let me stand up and show you how, how, how stupid that is. You see me standing? I'm not tall. I may appear tall. I may, I may be uh, the third tallest in my family in this household. But other than that, um, um, I'm 5'5". Five five. I'm the height of Frankie Valley. I could be 5'6". I could be above Frankie Valley, but the point being is I'm short. Um, <clears throat> if you hang around, if I would hang out with the Harlem Globetrotters, I, I would still be short the next day. <laughs> I, would not, I would not be the 6'8", 7'1", height that they are. No. <laughs> what didn't happen. And and also, um, the second reason is hanging around with people who identify as gay or or are in gay relationships will encourage other people to be gay. No. There are one night stands where people are curious and they have sex with the same sex, but then go back to having sex with the opposite sex. Um there are times in people's lives where they are curious what it is like to have sex with the other sex or to be in a relationship with the same sex. There are times when people are legitimately curious. But 
hanging if, if okay I'm pa- like I said I'm pansexual now if I <laughs> my friend Dennis my friend Dennis Tobias who I've known for years I hung out with him I told him on Facebook the next day that I'm pansexual does that mean when um I hang out with him next time that means he's gonna automatically become pansexual no the th- I, I, the it's just so stupid that uh, Oh, what's the third reason? Uh, legalizing gay marriage will open the door to all kinds of crazy behavior. People may even wish to marry their pets because a dog has legal standing and can sign a marriage. Uh, what? Uh, <clears throat> okay, I'm going to read this slowly. I I, I want to make sure I'm I'm I I I I I, I didn't I I I I I want to make sure I didn't hear things. Legalizing gay marriage will open the doors to all kinds of crazy behavior. Yeah, like what? Flaunting around our pride because uh, we're not straight. I'm sorry, but bullshit. That's not that's not strange behavior. Being happy is not strange behavior. Um. Oh. Oh. Besides, everybody's gay. Some. That's their uh, sexual orientation. But you know what? Everybody's gay in a way because gay also means happy. Gay has two meanings. It's a sexual orientation. And it's the other way of saying happy. So everybody's getting a lot of ways. Um, people may even wish to marry their... Okay. The, you all are crazy who think this. Um, gay marriage is nothing like bestiality. Now, bestiality are people who, are, who intentionally have this sexual fetish the sick sexual fetish to have sex and suck the cocks and lick and lick the titties of their cats, dogs that have sex with donkeys, horses. I'm not even kidding. Bestiality is animal cruelty and it's a crime. Gay marriage, on the other hand, is nothing like that. And 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 um, that there's a major difference between bestiality and gay marriage. People, get your heads out of your asses. Because a dog can sign legal standing and can sign a marriage contract. Hold on. This is my cat Oreo. Like a dog, he has hind legs and two front legs. Where's the opposable thumbs? There's opposable claws, but they can't sign anything. They're animals. They can't sign anything. What's what? What's the what? What? What's the fourth reason? Four, straight marriage has been around a long time and hasn't changed at all. Women are still property. Blacks still can't marry whites, and divorce is still illegal. Uh, 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 uh which history books are you reading? Um, the Bible, because if so, this is not a history book. This is a two thousand year old man written book. Okay, first of all, women are not property. Women are not second class citizens. Women are not men's sex slaves. Women are not men's sex slaves. Women are people. Treat them like people. Obviously, this is probably a guy who's in the basement jacking off to porn as we speak. Um, 
straight marriage has been around a long time. You know, first of all, this whole concept of straight marriage, do you even know what marriage is? In the Bible, I'm I'm sure this is his reference book to, uh, his or her reference book to um, what he or she is saying. But in the Bible, marriage is between a brother marrying his sister. That's not straight marriage. That's incest. There's a difference. There is a fucking difference. <sighs> Women are still properly bullshit. Blacks can still can marry whites. Bullshit. Interracial marriage was illegal up until 1967. When Lyndon Johnson was in office, he signed the civil rights form, which means the civil rights law, which means that black people could marry white people. Because Lyndon Johnson agreed with John F. Kennedy, and Lyndon Johnson seen, and I mean he'd seen, discrimination because he worked as a teacher in these poor communities. I know my history. And divorce is still illegal. No, it isn't. Divorce is not illegal. Oh. Divorce is not illegal. People can get divorced. Okay? People can get divorced. That's how the world works. If they've lost touch, if they don't, if people don't love one another, if 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 one is a, a psychopathic killer, and the his, the wife or husband finds out, they can get divorced. Straight marriage will reason number five. Straight marriage will be less meaningful if gay marriage is allowed. No, no. What, what causes you to think that if I decide to marry a man, if I was engaged to a man right now, let's say my ring on my uh, left hand, let's just say this was an engagement ring. If I was marrying a man, why would my marriage to my soon-to-be husband affect your marriage to your wife? It wouldn't. It wouldn't. It would. It it wouldn't. It just wouldn't. What? Ah! It wouldn't. And what's the um um italics underneath? The sanctity of Britney Spears's 55 hour for fun marriage will be destroyed. Uh, what? 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 No. But. No, no. Britney Spears, when she married that uh, sleaze bag, and he was a sleaze bag, um, she wasn't married for 55 hours just for fun. No, she was married for about a year and a half, and she was in an abusive relationship. So she is not at fault there. <laughs> I have a feeling there's more to number six, but maybe not. Straight marriages are valid, are more valid because they produce children. Um, 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 dipshit. Uh, who, who created this video? Cam Bear Red T E G C whatever your username is, you're a dipshit, okay? Um, straight marriages can are valid because they produce children. You, you know there's a, these things called surrogate parents where, like I said, if I were to marry a guy and if I were to have, want to have children, which I don't, I'm child-free by choice, but if I want to have my own children and my soon-to-be husband wanted to have his own children, we could, you know, uh, uh, um, you know, you, 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 uh, jack off and you put your sperm into a cup and then they take your partner's sperm and, and it's in a different cup and then they, they, they mix it 
they they put they they okay it's a long process but what they do is they take each sperm sample or each cup or a cup and a half of sperm and they then they mix it with your partner's sperm and they um and they and and if you have a f good friend or or um you know uh uh <clears throat> a uh, close relative of yours. I know some people do this, it's weird, but they still do it. Um, but if they, 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 uh, it's called surrogate parenting. And, um, um, it's when a woman is artificially inseminated with the gay couple's sperm, and then, um, then when the child's born, you kind of figure out which father it looks like. But, uh, you no know, gay marriages can uh, produce children just in a different way, and also child free by choice is on the rise because there's seven billion people on this planet. So uh, um, um, we need to <whistles> keep lower it to like 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 maybe like four billion before people can start like really reproducing again. <laughs> Number seven, gay couples, infertile couples, and old shouldn't be allowed, wait, wait, gay couples, infertile couples, and old people shouldn't be allowed to marry because their orphanages aren't full yet, and the world needs more children. No, honey, the world does not need any more children. Like I said, we need to lower it to four billion people. We, there's too many fucking people. And and what about oh, what old people can't get married? Why? Well, why? It, well, if it's a guy who's finally marrying the girl of his dreams, seventy at age seventy, and she's still alive at at the same age or younger, why why shouldn't they get married? And it, it, that that's is, that's a valid marriage, and, and that would be example of a straight marriage. Infertile couples. What's an infertile couple? I have no idea what that means. Infertile. Uh, a person on a plant unable to reap. Oh, oh, sterile people. Okay. Sterile. Okay, so sterile people shouldn't get married. Let me explain. Um, when someone is told by, if a woman is told by her gynecologist and her, uh, and a guy is told by his, um, um, doctor that she or he is sterile um uh, strange strange stuff has happened have you ever seen um the movie with ben stiller uh where they there it's like he creates this like community watch neighborhood watch and um ben stiller's character is sterile and then at the end of the movie you find out that for in, in some strange way, his, like, sperm had, like, a, like, turnaround or something, and he impregnated his wife in the film. So, um, uh, people who are infertile, yeah, they can be married. So can, like I said, gay couples. We can, we can get married. Um... <clears throat> Obviously, gay parents will raise gay children since straight parents will... <sighs> Sexuality is not determined how you're raised. Sexuality is determined of how you're born. Being gay is not a choice. Being pansexual is not a choice. Being lesbian is not a choice. Being bisexual is not a choice. Being transgender is not a choice. Being transqueer is not a choice. We're fucking born this way. Being straight is not a choice. You're born that way. We're born this way, 
and and you know how we know that we we aren't we don't choose to be this way because our chemicals in the brain our chemicals in the brain are different from of straight people so do we exactly know how um how uh um gay gay genes or gay genetics are formed at birth no we all know that to a full extent we have estimations we have uh, um there's a as estimate estimations at, at estimations I don't, I don't think that's a word there's estimates uh, um, estimates yeah estimates there's estimates out there that that say that um, one of the I, ideas is that when a, a woman is carrying a male child that maybe that since the woman's hormone, but woman's body is not used to masculinity or um, like a testosterone type feeling. Uh, in some cases, um, a woman's estrogen will affect the XY chromosomes, and maybe that's how gay men and gay women are born uh, we we all know to a full extent of how we're born this way is including straight people we all know you don't, you don't even know how you're born uh what makes you straight what makes me pan what makes someone else gay what makes someone else lesbian we don't know there's estimates there's estimates that's all we can say with science modern science there's estimates of how we can say how some people can be born gay some people get born lesbian some people some people can be born pansexual some people some people can be born transgender, some people can be born straight, but we don't know exactly how our sexual orientation is formed. We know chemicals in the brains are uh, in the brain are a leading factor to it, but we we do, truly don't know to a full extent. So if there are gay parents, maybe they have a straight child. Maybe they have a gay child. It depends on how the child's born. And like I said, my mom. Okay. Um. I'm sorry, but that's wrong. My father, my my father's straight, my mother's straight, my sister's straight. I'm pansexual. I'm sorry. I mean, that's my stepfather, but he is truly my father. But my uh, um, uh, paternal father, my biological father, I should say, um, <clears throat> was straight. So I'm pansexual. So um, um, doesn't necessarily mean that if you have a, a a straight marriage, that means your son, daughter, or daughter who think who who really feels like she should be a he or son that really thinks he should be a she is necessarily going to be straight. <sighs> Gay marriage is not supported by religion. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Bullshit, bullshit upon bullshit. While it's true, conservative Christians and conservative sh extremists of any religion don't, don't like gay marriage, but, they, but this fundamentalist is using Leviticus chapter 20, verses 13, saying, no man shall lie with a man, just how no woman shall lie with a woman outside of marriage because it's a punch, it's punishable by death. Very Christian-like. Um, <clears throat> while there are passages in the Bible, though, that do support same-sex marriage. Just saying. <laughs> In a theocracy like ours, the values of one religion are imposed on the entire country. Bullshit. America is a melting pot. It is. There's Jewish people here. There's Christians. There's Muslims. There's atheists. Why? There's, there's a Jedis. I'm not even kidding. That's a religion. There's Buddhists. There's Hindus. There's... Shigama Daga Dinga Dinga Gunga, what, for all I know. But um, but the thing is, there's so many different religions in this country, it's not just Christianity. 
That's why we only have one religion in the world. Bullshit. There's many. <laughs> Children can never succeed without a male and female role model at home. Bullshit. That's the way we as a society expressively forbid single parents to raise children. <sighs> Before my parents lived together, my I, I even though I lived in a household with family, my mother was a single mother and and um she did a pretty good job of raising a intellectual, compassionate person. So single parents can do a good job but without a husband or without a wife or without a hus yeah, yeah, you know what I mean. Ten, gay marriage will change the foundation of society. Foundation of society? No, it won't. No, it won't. Gay mar even though gay marriage is legal in this country now, because that video is from 2009, but people still go by these bullshit reasons. But even still, gay marriage changed the foundation of our society in what way? It's just giving people like me the right to be married. And although people who identify as pansexual, trans, transgender, trans, queer, gay, bi, lesbian, questioning and so forth. We have a long way to go for protection rights towards people like us. But um, how will it change the foundation of our society? There's racist still, there's sexist still, there's sexist still, yeah, blah, 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 it's getting too late for me. There's sexist still in society, there's rapist still in society, there's murderer still in society, there's horrible people in the world, there's um, 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 criminals in our political system. Yeah, how does that change the, how does gay marriage change the foundation of our society? How? As far as I see, gay marriage being legal, if it changes the foundation in our society as a positive way, great, great. Maybe there's, maybe more accepting people will come out and say, hey, Gay people should have the right to be married. But, um, but with that being said, though, it, it, if, it won't change the foundation of our society because America's society will always be, and this will forever be the mentality of America since 9-11. If you're not an American, if you're not white, if you're not straight, if you're not religious, there's a problem with you. This is the mentality of, of the majority of conservatives in this country. I'll, uh, why there's more liberals in this country, though, but still, conservatives are more vocal than liberals and libertarians are. And liberals, let's step up to the plate. Let's kick these assholes in the asses. Um, but, yeah, gay marriage will not change the foundation of our society. You know why? Because America's... In America, there will, always, there will always be prejudice. There will always be racism. There will always be sexism. There will always be rapists walking the streets. Well, not necessarily always, but for the most part. But the point being is, it, it won't change the foundation of our society. It won't. It won't. It can create a positive change in our society, but that's about it. See you guys.